Guys, this is the start of the vlog. I didn't think it was gonna be like this, but Teggy got herself in a little bit of a situation last night. I'm gonna go inside and explain that, but uh, yeah, let's just get to that real quick. What's up, you guys? If this is your first time here, my name is Tay Lopez, driver 1994 Acura Integra, B20 V swap. I'm from San Diego, California. Nothing crazy, I'm just a kid who likes to film videos of me building my car and all the experiences that go on in my life. So that way, if anybody is ever looking up things on cars or they wanna get a car, or they just need to see kind of an image of what's going on and what you're getting yourself into, they can watch my channel and see all the stuff I come along. So um, I'm gonna talk pretty quick cause it's kind of warm and it's summertime and my car's hot. So uh, last night this happened to me, that happened to me. And uh, I got pulled over for my exhaust and my tent, he said. Uh, honestly, I just went to like a little meet that was like right by the beach by my house like maybe 15 20 minutes away And uh, once I started driving down there There was already so many cops down there and I was like wow This is crazy just for a little park and chill and I noticed that it, something weird was going on And once we left we went in like a cul-de-sac and we made a u-turn and we went past the light The light was green. I was in second gear. I was probably going like eight miles per hour, maybe ten and uh Next thing you know, uh, we're sitting at a red light and my friend Manny's like right behind me on my butt. Shout out Manny. He cut off this other cop to literally block me so the cop couldn't see me. And somehow we're sitting at the red light and this motorcycle cop comes right on the side of us. And he lights me up for no reason. Pulls me over. There's like four cops behind me at this point. And just, just for literally a pulled over tent and exhaust, they had four cops. I'm not going to talk any crap or anything because that's not me. The law enforcement's just doing their job, I understand. But it was just annoying that I was driving my car. I wasn't being loud. I was just going to a park and chill. Actually, just to hang out with people and look at their cars. And sometimes it's cool to do that. Sometimes it's cool. I work on my car. I put in hard work. And, like, I just want to go see what other people are doing. And see what, what other car enthusiasts are doing. Maybe get some ideas. I don't know. But, honestly, I don't know. There's not a lot I can really say to this. I thought I would just explain my state rep to you guys. So that way you guys can get an understanding of how it all went for me. I wasn't mobbing. I wasn't doing anything crazy. I literally was just driving normal. And he pulled me over for 10 exhaust. And... He gave me the state rep for exhaust. That's crazy. It's the first time it's ever happened to me. So it kind of hurt my heart in the beginning of it all. But then uh, last night I called my friend Joey. My friend Joey is really good with this stuff. And he told me not to stress on it. There's a trick to it for sure. You just got to find it. And then this morning I woke up and Mr. Ticket, I don't know if you guys know who he is. I'm going to put his Instagram somewhere. Probably like right there, right down there. But um, he hit me up on Instagram and he was willing actually to help me out with my case and handling this problem. So we're going to be doing work together and I'm really excited about that. He really brought a lot more hope to me about this whole situation. Uh, I will keep you guys updated for sure what happens after this because I will definitely make a video after all of this. But I didn't want to just get state wrapped and not tell you guys anything. I know you guys probably see my Instagram posts and... I don't know, like I said before, I wanted to get in the vibe of making videos again, and some of me knew that this video had to be put out there just because this is something going on in my life, and it's a moment going on, and I don't know. I want to show you guys that there's no reason to stress when you get a state rep, honestly, because there's always a way to handle it, and there's always a way to do things. You just have to be calm, honestly. I'm learning patience still, so... We're learning together, but um, I'm gonna do a little walk around on the outside of my car and just show you guys what's going on, what's new, what's great, what's what's new, you know? Um, we have gotten a long way in this car. Now it's a really, really good daily. That's why it's annoying that we got this, but we're not gonna let it stop us. The cops said I can still drive from work, home, school. So I'm still gonna drive the car little places here and there, probably just down the street because my job is only down the street. But um, besides that, I'm probably gonna take it a little easy until this court case is all done, but um yeah let's just get to the walking around it's not gonna be a crazy video i just had to explain myself but uh thank you guys for coming to the channel thank you for supporting i appreciate all of you so much big things coming for the channel this year be prepared i'm gonna stop talking now and just start doing the walk around let's get it all right you guys please ignore the ugly hood uh i got the hood like that i never rinsed it down that is not for my car please do not comment anything that's for my car look at my motor my motor is nice and clean and pretty it's looking nice and good. When I first got this car, honestly, this thing looked like a whole pile of junk. There was leaks everywhere. The mountain was blown out. The back one and this one was blown out. Uh, I don't know, it just, it was really ugly. It made so many noises. Honestly, when I got the car, I towed it home. So that explains a lot to the car. But I thought I'd just do like a little walk around and show you guys like the progression I've gotten with my car. And honestly, I feel like I have came a long way because before, like I said, I did tow the car home and it would drive for like a couple days and it would break down, drive for a couple days and break down. Now this is actually my serious daily driver and the state ref kind of did do me up on that one Shout out to my girlfriend though. She's got the daily so we can be whipping that one But uh, yeah, I just sometimes I like to show you guys the progression of what I've got how far I've got This is my motor now. Uh, I kept the same block rebuilt my transmission got a new head uh, For the outside. I got a whole new front end I'm gonna be looking for doors next and a hatchback so I can get this paint job done 
Um, I got side skirts. I repainted my back bumper. I got these uh, tail lights for my friend Dustin. Like I said, I've done a lot of stuff to the car, a little, a lot of little things, but all the little things start to add up later. And now it's almost time for paint. I got all my suspension redone. I got all my motor work done. Now all I need is doors, hatchback, paint. And then uh, that will be the done deal with that. I also want to get some wheel spacers too, because I want to get my fitment a little better. I kind of want to roll my fenders, have the wheel popping out a little bit, nothing crazy. And I also want to invest in that brake light thing for the back wing. That's another investment. There's a bunch of little investments I need to get. Nothing crazy, but slowly coming along. That one, I could agree. Hard work pays off. I could agree to that one, honestly. It honestly feels so great. It's a fun daily. I cleaned up everything. Shout out to everyone that helped. And uh, honestly, be ready to see this car back on the road better than ever, because I got a couple more things I want to do. My birthday's coming up on June 14th. I need a turbo. I don't know. Hopefully I can make that happen. Don't quote me on anything, but this is what the car is looking like right now, guys. So I hope you guys enjoy this little video. It's nothing crazy. Just wanted to do a quick little walk around, show you guys what I got, what I have, what's new, and uh, explain my state ref as much as I can. I'm not in the best of mood, so I hope you guys enjoyed this, but uh, I'm always happy. That's so, it doesn't really matter. Later.